Blood and convalescent plasma are still very much needed by blood centers around the country during the pandemic. But what if you've already received the vaccine? 12 News reporter Alexandra Leslie spoke with the Rhode Island Blood Center to find out what you need to know before you donate. As more Americans are starting to receive their first dose of a COVID-19 vaccine, the FDA says those who got one cannot donate convalescent plasma. The FDA says a clinical trial would need to be held to determine if those who have received a COVID-19 vaccine can donate convalescent plasma safely. Everything is still so new and there is uncertainty around the quality of the antibodies as it relates to convalescent plasma. The plasma taken from the blood of recovered COVID-19 patients is used on an emergency approval basis by the FDA to treat hospitalized COVID-19 patients. But that makes it all the more important that we are able to identify people who have the antibodies and are willing to donate convalescent plasma. One of the ways Rhode Island Blood Center is doing that, testing all of its regular blood donations. It was December 14th that we began the testing and it is definitely running through the end of January. Um, it may extend past that. While you can't donate convalescent plasma after getting a COVID vaccine, Rhode Island Blood Center says you can still help. Blood donations, platelet donations, they are needed just as much, and there is no deferral period if you receive the Pfizer vaccine or the Moderna vaccine. If you receive another vaccine like AstraZeneca's, which has not yet been approved by the FDA, you have to wait two weeks after getting vaccinated to donate regular blood. We've got more details on donor criteria and how to schedule a donation in this story on WPRI.com. I'm Alexandra Leslie, 12 News.